Hey, we're back in business. Back in business. All right, so we got Water World, which is objectively terrible. Yeah. Lava World, which is probably also terrible. And then Poison World, which is also Blight Town. Plague Knight's Explodatorium is probably the most... I'd say these two, the Lava and the uh, Explodatorium, are the most bearable. I, I mean, it wins just by its name. <laughs> you, you can't go wrong with an Explodatorium. All right, so this is a thing. Mm-hmm. Oh. Pretty simple thing. Whoosh! It's a neat little animation. Oh, you just go straight through those. Mm-hmm. Ah, can I kill this? Nope. These what? are these, these are platformer enemies. They're not affected by the world around them. What? They explode. They're exploding rats. Oh, no. <laughs> so there's probably a secret room that I have to unlock by getting an enemy to run into it. Um, no. No, anything... Really? Wow, they dropped the ball on that, then. That would have been great. I mean, any any wall that can be destroyed can be destroyed by you. So. What? I can't kill the exploding rat with an exploding rat? No. Oh, what? shit. I can't remember who Plague Knight fights. Oh, that's right. When you're playing as Plague Knight, you fight Shovel Knight here. Because you do the same overworld. You just, fight, you just fight everybody like normal. You just have a different reason for it. Gotcha. And your base of operations is actually in the bar, like in the, <laughs> like in a secret area below it. I don't like this bomber thing. Well, the levels only get get more challenging. I think. I think all of these are about the same. These three. A carrot. Mm -hmm. It's not. It's not as good as chicken. Damn right, it's not. That's good. <sighs> that is so dumb. Come on. <laughs> Come on, give me just that. Look, Ryan, I've never played a platforming game where the, an exploding uh, effect from an enemy ever hurt anybody other than me. All right, Ryan, what 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 what, what have you been what have you been doing playing since uh, since last we buckled our shoes together like this? Just, just lots of tanks. Lots of tanks. Lots of tanks. I do uh, I do need to go back and play some Resident Evil 4, though, because Jimmy got me that for Christmas. Mmm. Okay. Love Resident Evil 4. Did you have any... Uh, did you see anything with Resident Evil 7? I did. I think it looks stupid. You were actually right. You were <laughs> actually right. There's no way you could have hit that. I forgot. You were 100% right. Oh, I needed to hit it with yeah. the rat? Yeah. I completely forgot. Yeah. You called it. So much for, oh, way to be wrong at everything, Ryan. <laughs> way to be bad at the game, Ryan. But I can't remember, what did you say about Resident Evil 7? It looks dumb. Yeah? I think VR stuff is too gimmicky, at least for it's, now. Yeah, it's not strictly VR, though. Like, like Eve Valkyrie yeah. is strictly VR, which is ass. But... Now, Resident Evil 7... Oh, come on. I would never play Resident Evil 7 in VR. Not because it's too scary, but, um... Because your arms are disembodied. Oh. And that looks stupid. I've seen Resident Evil 7, and... I, there are parts of it that I like. Uh... They made it a little bit more... Uh, I'll say... Impactfully scary, rather than just, like... You know, they, they do it by... They try to... They spook you with quality over quantity. And I don't mean by saying that it's better. I just mean that they have individual things that are scary. Rather what than... What the fuck is going on here? There's like a Pokemon flying around. There's fucking... <laughs> there's potions. And... What is this place? I have... I know I've told somebody before. Probably you. I've never played a Resident Evil game. Just ever. I might have, I might have really, yeah, I might have touched Resident Evil 4 once, but never sat down and played any of them. I like Silent Hill. Uh, I played that bad one called Homecoming. Uh, I played. I think my favorite one that I actually played was The Room. Uh, Silent Hill 4, I think. If okay, up there. Oh. And, uh, yep. Nope. I was wrong. Okay, try and... There we go, there it is. Uh, oh, man, yeah. you can't, it even tries to trick you with the fall down yep. stuff, and... <sighs> yep. I, I don't like... 
I don't like this game design. Look, man. Look, man, it's a good game. It's a good game. You're gonna say it's not a good game? Nope. Oh, God. Yep. Wait a minute. It's a new relic. I can do... Boundless combat potential. I mean, you do know that these are usually set up so that the new relic gets you right through it. That would be good game design, and I don't expect that from these people. That is exactly what they do in these situations. In the last place, you got to phase log it so you could walk through that stupid area. There's Chester again. Whoa! How did you know Chester was going to be here, Ryan? Did you play this game before? So I, I feel the urge to murder rising deep within my bosom whenever I see a blue chest. Maybe you just don't like blue chests. No, I don't want to see. Oh, you know what? Never mind. The orb was better. Toss a coin for a chance at riches. I hate the coin. It's dumb. It, it does look really bad. I need to use my boundless combat potential to beat this guy. <laughs> Yes! <laughs> I, uh, actually really liked some of the... Boundless potential! <laughs> <laughs> what is this? There you go. Wow! Bound combat potential. That's right. To say the least. Known combat potential. <laughs> Obs Fi finite. Observable. Yes. But as I've been, uh, meaning to say, like, four times, uh... There Whoa! There are some Pokemon Mega Evolutions that I like. Like, I thought Pokemon Origin was pretty fucking cool. Yeah. Uh, the way they just brought out Mega fucking Charizard like that. That was neat. But, um, my favorite Pokemon will always be fucking Entei. Really? I thought he was ugly. I just like him because he's like a big lion dog and I want to hug him. Oh, damn. Shit, that whole fucking pillar exploded. Mm-hmm. Oh, God. <laughs> Look, Ryan. They're not gonna. They're not gonna eliminate every platform. Just, 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 just the ones that matter. Yeah, but I probably need to get a move on because there's gonna be like some secret or some shit that I can't fucking get if oh. I don't fucking stop <laughs> bouncing off of fucking bullshit. I gotta go fast. Nope. It's too bad. It's nope. It's too. You missed it. Oh fuck. Hey, it's the boss. Oh no, it's the mini boss. Excuse me, sir. What the hell is your problem? Sure is hard. Interesting. What? No, I hit him there. Don't give me that. But yeah, I think the idea is. Oh. Yeah. No, yeah. This is the idea. You just fucking go up and go. Just in a real tight spot there. You're right, Chris. And once you get the hang of the bosses, you know, it's really just a matter of sitting somewhere retarded the developers didn't think you would and just beat the crap out of them. I'm positive that they that they did think you would, and most of the relics are just for fun. That, that's definitely a trouble. They always seem to give the invincibility one. Yeah, I don't know. Oh, nice. Ah. Huh. Yeah. Oh, it's getting spicy. Ooh, it's becoming a spicy stage. Ooh. Oh, this is <laughs> this is something else right here. <laughs> boundless combat potential. Alright, there are items that give you boundless platforming potential. Is there a jetpack? Um Come on. Not specifically. Mmm. Face my combat potential <laughs> and see that it is boundless. Man, this thing is this is attacking from like a really rough angle there. Mm -hmm. Wait a minute. What? Oh! I'm really glad that you're paying attention here. Yeah, give me that carrot. Because I'm just thinking... No! <laughs> <laughs> wait, wait. I have an idea. You have two blue chalices. Oh yeah. There you go. Let's just get this going. That's using your head parts. It's a chalice, not my head. Oh my. Whoa, what the hell's going on here? Oh, it's a, it's a fake. It's a clone. There's mimics of me. It's a homunculus. 
Oh, doesn't he know how to get over here? Nope. He did. He wasn't made with a brain. He was just made with a whole lot of heart. Oh. <laughs> I'm trying to wonder. Shovel Knight is the only knight with a shovel. How's it got to feel to be no, him? No, he's got the Black Knight, remember? Oh, that's right. Oh, I missed the golden hole. The, the wall dirt. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> they know how to, they know how to downstab. They know how to do that. Wait a minute, how do you get up there? You bounce off the dirt. Are you serious? Mm -hmm. Come on. Bye-bye. <laughs> oh, no. Nope. Nope. Whoa. Yeah. <laughs> it's just like, this is the end of the line for me. I really feel like I should have quit my boundless... Wait a minute, the textures don't mm -hmm. match. Mm-hmm, that's right. And you know what a checkpoint in chicken mean? It's a bo 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 Oh, did you just skip the cutscene? <laughs> oh wait, you can do that? Yeah, I think you just hit start. What is this? Oh, he's just a he's just a hopping madman. He's this just is a, some crazy bullshit. He's just a loon. I am getting my ass kicked. I think right there when he's doing that is when you want to get up on him. But he doesn't do it that often. He throws shit in the way though. You mm -hmm. can't jump at him. I know. And he always teleports away. Man, you going all in? You're going all in. I gotta get up in his face. He is he is as fun to play as he looks. I'll tell you that. Uh oh. You might want to start using that phase logit. Whoa, buddy. Dude, you need to calm the fuck down. <laughs> it seems really hard to get a hit in on him though. It is. It is quite fucking difficult. It's it's pretty much just dodging. Uh, I need to equip my boundless combat potential. Boundless combat potential. <laughs> so boundless. <laughs> just, just so boundless, I hey, can't fucking hit him. You got two hits in. That's good. That's more. Yeah, than... one of them was my shovel. <laughs> you just gotta become a hopping madman like him, Ryan. You just gotta be hopping, hip hopping. He's he is such a bastard. You should see if you still have your chalice. I don't know. I, I guess I do. You might. I can't remember. What's retained after I death? I don't think I'm gonna kill him though. Right? Well, I mean, you're closer. Nope. All right. That's all right. It's just time to get good. Yep. I think you can hurt people when you're phased. So. I'm gonna try it. Yeah. What the hell? I, I I'm pretty sure that that's that that's what I did against one of the knights. No matter the boss, jumping on them is still always optimal. I don't know how I feel about that. Jeez. That that was pretty skillful that, right there. That was fucking clutch, man. Yeah, I think the only times I ever actually like mm. swung at a boss. It, it, it was it was rare. It's rare when I swing at bosses with the shovel. I was I'm always jumping on them, always hip hop them. Just don't swing that way. Right. Oh, I didn't have the catching dream. No, it happens every other boss, I believe. That's weird. It is, but if they did it every night, that would just get annoying. <laughs> Who is that? We do have a little bit of time. Well, no, it might be difficult. He might be difficult, so let's save him for the next one. All right. Save him for the next one. So, that's, it. that's, that's three down. That's three nights down. We made it to the next village. The armor outpost. Yup. Tune out on this one. Come on, come on back. Watch the next one. Uh, yeah. Fucking bring all your weed. Most of it. Help me get this music page too. Do that. Uh, I'll, <laughs> I'll show you how to get that. <laughs>